Hello everyone, welcome to Fena's channel. Uh, my name is Gosha, I'm a co-founder of Fena. And in this video I actually wanted to debunk um, objection um, I tend to get from time to time from my prospective clients that I talk to. As I mentioned, or you, you might know, um, Fena, one of the, our um, services that we offer is open banking payments. And uh, quite a few of my customers, especially customers that sell to other businesses, they say, say to me, Gosha, I don't think open banking is right for us because we sell to other businesses. And I think I would say, and my reaction is like, actually, because you're selling to other businesses, open banking is perfect for you. And the reason I'm saying this, because open banking sometimes needs a little bit of introduction. And if you're a business and you're selling to other businesses, you tend to have time and an ear of your customers to explain to them and ask them to be paid in a specific way. And if open banking will save you money and give you access to cash instantly from your payments, I see little reason why you wouldn't go to your customers, especially the other businesses, and tell them, guys, now when you pay me every month, can you please use open banking to pay me? Because it saves me money. It's that simple. And I struggle to see how other businesses would be would object to it saying like oh i don't want to pay you with open banking because why i mean there's a question i think usually business people are quite reasonable people and because they're quite reasonable if you give them a reasonable request they're going to give you a favor and just go with whatever you ask them to do and asking someone to be paid with open banking for a good or goods or services that you're selling to your customers especially with the business customers are actually quite a reasonable request. So I give you an example. Let's say you are a business that sells, supplies, let's say hardware, hardware and let's say to a construction businesses, yeah? So you are a hardware store and a hardware supplier to, uh, to businesses to, uh, that operate within uh, construct, uh, construction sector. Let's say you have a, a every month uh, they buy from you a certain number of various things they might need to uh, might need for the for the work, and let's say your average invoice is about five k. Normally they will pay by card or bank transfer, um, but those two methods a bank uh, bank transfer can be slow. You, you often need to chase, need to spend admin time on uh, reconciliation of your payments. On the, on the other uh, hand, uh, card payments are expensive, so uh, a fees on 5k will be quite significant. So what you can do, you can ask the business saying, by the way, this is your 5k invoice, here's a payment link, can you use that payment link to pay me? And it will save me loads of money, or it saves me time reconciling your payment, do you mind doing this? And I'll probably say nine out of 10 times, they will just go with it. And once they try open banking and pay you open banking and see how easy it is, how seamless that is, and how easy it's for them to just make a payment directly from the bank account to your bank account without needing to find a reference number, needing to find your sort coin account number, and then double checking the amount to the pennies. If they just try it, I bet that the next month they don't even ask, they just use that payment link to pay again and again and again. So I think this video will be quite short because in this video, what I want you to do, I want you to, I want to encourage you to try open banking for business payments. Just sign up, generate payment link and ask one of your customers to pay using open banking and see how easy it is. If you like to find out more about open banking and Fena, please drop me a line or drop our team a line uh, at port at fena.co. You can also visit our website, fena.co. 
If you have any question, leave them in the comments. I probably at some point will do a Q&A session where I address all the questions in the comments. In the meantime, have a lovely day and I see you soon.